Hello everyone! Today we are going to special meeting. It will be only between girls. So no men. And uh, there will be a lot of dishes. I'm going on this kind of meeting first time, so I'm very excited. Look, I'm wearing new poncho. Very, very excited. Oh my god. Okay, I will let you see what the dishes will be there. Do you know, guys? Do you know? When I come to Pakistan, I change very much. Uh, like, first I was feeling very... Why is like this? Why is like this? Like, angry and uh, not... Don't agree with everything, but slowly, slowly I become... <laughs> Different, very different. Sparky, <coughs> Sparky wants this chicken. Put the water here and I'm going to wait for the boy, the water. Then I'm going to add the milk and the tea leaves. Well, now you want some tea? No, I don't want. Okay, I was saying that I changed very much after my uh, marriage and it's exactly true because uh, you know I come to new new place new family new country new climate everything absolutely different and it was a uh, little difficult for me but i have some good changes in me like i become more careful i become more soft more kind maybe in some things more uh, like forgive easily and don't say rude words like this is bad things and the best thing which was changed in me it is uh, that i become a muslim the best thing is that i become a muslim i start to know about islam and everything because of my marriage a little clip I'm doing nothing, I'm <laughs> only making videos. <laughs> but making videos also very difficult. Now we boil in milk. Now Rabia will give us recipe of Pakistani tea. <laughs> and now, and after a little boil, I'm going to add more. Let's talk about what you have after marriage. Usually, if you marry on someone from your country and your culture, it's not so difficult. But there is also like some changes in your life. Like you have to be more careful, uh, clean house, 
cook, do everything, take care of your husband, also have good relationships with his family, with his um, parents, brothers, sisters, uncles. Uh, related to country, of course, related to traditions. But the main thing is uh, before marry, uh, people should talk about how they see their life, uh, what is their wishes, what they can do, what they cannot do about children. So, so like for example, do you want to live with parents of your husband or not? Uh, do you want to live separately? Do you want to... Uh, where you want to live? How you want to live? Like, you will work, you will not work. Uh, about money also. Like, you know, money of husband is your money also, but your money is only your money, and things like this. <coughs> What? Don't tell you. <laughs> it's just for family to remember. I will not do it. Yum yum. It's not that Cody. Auntie Cody is here. I will be Cody. Yeah. What? <laughs> it's all good. It's not that sweet you want. Now I come back to my home, to my house. Yeah, it was a very good day. Uh, we spent uh, some good time with uh, my um, mother-in-law's friends. Uh, we was eating, we was talking. Uh, I also need uh, uh, <laughs> how to say <laughs> like mama's friend's uh, daughter-in-law and she has a cute son I like them so much so I want to come there again and uh, it was very nice meeting a lot of dishes a lot of food uh, I also did namaz there like everything very very good hospitality uh, what i want to say about topic which i was talking uh, when you when you want to like have relationships marry someone uh, the most important thing is talk with each other and uh, like ask about things ask about how what kind of life you want and uh, with what kind of things you agree uh, even in small things like uh, about you know daily routine like who is like to wash dishes who want to do like cleaning who want to cook because sometimes uh, men like to cook more and cooking better. <laughs> this is my this is my type. Uh, like for example, me and the Lee don't like dirty things. Like we like to be clean. We like simple things. There should be some things uh, which is uh, will be same between you and your love. So 
you will have some sim similar things and you will feel more close to each other and in bad times it will not disturb you <laughs> hmm. when you already married it's very important to just don't broke your relationships don't destroy everything and i know uh, if your husband is good if he is doing everything for you what he can in that moment but you still not satisfied it's not a good thing that you let him see that you uh, unhappy that you unsatisfied that you want more 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 things because he will feel that who I am, I cannot do anything, I cannot make my love happy, how I should live then. And also one more thing, it is when you fighting, I know everyone is fighting, even one time in uh, your life you will definitely fight with your husband, but it's, it's normal, it's uh, coming and going. It's not a big deal, it's not a big problem. If you will not say rude words, if you will not just start fighting on small, small things like why you put this dirty thing there or why you come back home so late or why you uh, don't take breakfast or why you take breakfast without me or other, other, other small things which is not actually important in all the life. It is just uh, small parts of your day. And when you like reacting negativity, re when you reacting negatively, when you aggressive, when you uh, let him see that you hate him because of these things, that you really hate it, uh, he or she, they will feel very bad. And slowly, slowly, if it will happen more and more times, daily or weekly, it can destroy your relationship. It will not be like first days of your marriage when you love, when you love each other, when you like, uh, you my cute, you my good, I love you, and things like this. No, you will look at each other and just feel very sad that all this happening every day. So, it's <laughs> one thing which I want to say, that we don't need to fight in small things, we don't need to uh, say bad things or that we are not satisfied because of some small mistakes because uh, our partner is doing everything for us and uh, it's also not so big problem always remember that this life will end one day and after this if you will meet Allah what you will say to him that I was uh, inserting my love because I was not satisfied how she put my food on the plate, it was dirty, or that tea was cold, or other things. It's, it's so small things. And uh, just leave it, just leave it. Just don't react on it, just forget. Okay, you angry, just... <laughs> um, yes, that's what I wanted to say. Uh, the, it was very uh, good time spent today. Inshallah, I will have a good day tomorrow also. Uh, and you too, you too. If you like these videos and these vlogs please subscribe this channel please put uh, this like um, please put this uh, link please click this bell on 
and also like if you have something to say me about topic which I was talking or something else, you can text in comments. We will reply you. So take care of yourself. I love this.